Eamon Holmes, 63, has been struck down with a myriad of health disasters over the last two years which had left him largely immobilized and unable to work. He had already been suffering with immense pain as a result of three slipped discs in his back which affected the movement in his right leg. Then, Eamon underwent spinal surgery in a bid to ease the hellish pain. However, the operation left him with a weakened left leg. Just two weeks after the operation, Eamon's leg gave way at the top of a spiral staircase at the Surrey home he shares with wife Ruth Langsford, 62. Recalling the frightening accident in a new interview, the GB News presenter explained that he had been heading to join Ruth in bed at around 2 a.m. He told Daily Mail, suddenly it was as if someone had shot my left knee from behind. It literally collapsed without any warning. I was on a curve of the stairs, and I just went back down the stairs, boom, boom, boom down the whole staircase until I hit the stone floor in the hallway. Eamon said he fell on his front and ended up with blood pouring out of his mouth and a bone sticking out of his shoulder. Ruth heard the commotion and rushed down the stairs. Eamon continued, she kept saying, you're fine, everything's okay, you're fine. I said, Ruthie, there is a bone sticking out of my shoulder, I'm not fine. The worried loose women panelist called an ambulance and Eamon had surgery on his shoulder. He remained at the hospital for a week before moving to a private rehabilitation center where he stayed for six weeks. His recovery was slower than he hoped and he became frustrated at relying so much on other people, especially Ruth. Ruth also opened up that dealing with Eamon's health woes had been terrible. She told her Loose Women co-stars, It's been a really difficult time, so I took some time off really to be at home and look after him. And then very sadly his mum passed away in the middle of all that so it's been a terrible time. Eamon's beloved mother Josie passed away in November, just two weeks before he 94th birthday. Tragically, Eamon's mobility issues meant he was unable to attend her funeral and his siblings were left to carry her coffin without him. Eamon finally returned to work at GB News alongside his co-host, Isabel Webster, earlier this month. After four months away, Eamon said he is not better, but better than I was. He tweeted, I've decided to make an attempt to go back to work on GB News from tomorrow on the basis that work, hopefully, will heal me. And any of you who are long-term sick or, you know, in any way convalescing at home, will know that there is a lot of frustration involved in it. For me, I'm going to give it a go, be back to work, and hopefully get better as a result of doing day-to-day -day things. Breakfast airs daily on GB News from 6 a.m.